also an extreme leftist and a nationalist, will be the next president of Mexico. He won in a landslide. He will be inaugurated on December 1st. Uh, his name is Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador. Let's get to any of these elements, guys. There we go. There's the VO, half slab there. Joe, I saved this full screen for you. AMLO is what he goes by. It's his nickname. It is an acronym for Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador. Like I said before, you call him President Lopez Obrador. President Lopez, do not call him President Obrador. Two last names. We Latins are difficult like that. Luisa Cabrera. Yeah, yeah exactly. Um, what is true is he trounced the traditional parties, like we've seen in a lot of places in the world. Right. He came in with about 54% of the vote. Look at the uh, number two and number three, distant second and thirds for the establishment parties. Uh, he did not run on his hard left a campaign as he's done the last two times. He moved more towards the center and ran very much on anti-corruption and anti-crime. President Trump tweeting out uh, late last night, congratulations to Andres Manuel Lopez Obrador on becoming the next president of Mexico. I look very much forward to working with him. There is much to be done that will benefit both the United States and Mexico. You want to watch the way the peso trades to get a sense of what the markets think. As he softened, markets got uh, softened his leftist rhetoric. Uh, markets uh, grew calmer when he spoke last night. I didn't see the speech but myself, it was, it was but it was conciliatory. Already, peso was down 10 percent the last week, wasn't it, or the last month as he got, did better and better in the polls? Yes, for and sure, but there's also the issue of NAFTA, right? That's the problem yeah. with the peso is it's also very much what is Trump in, 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 in the situation with NAFTA. When he's been more conciliatory and talked about spending less, the, the peso has rallied, but there's a lot to go between now and December 1. So I think AMLO is going to stick. I'm so, it's like MBS. I, I, you know, I mm. that was yeah. Oh, I, I think everybody's going to call yeah, yeah. him AMLO. The same way Lula. Once he became president of, of Brazil, still everybody just called him Lula. I think everybody's going to call him AMLO. So you, you're sensitive. About what? Caruso Cabrera. I mean, it's not, if someone calls you Cabrera, it's... It's, uh, it's wrong if you call me Cabrera. Okay. You can call me Caruso or Caruso Cabrera. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. 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 Just, yeah I'm learning something. Yeah, no, yeah. I know. It's, like, uh, so Carlos Slim is Carlos Slim Hilu. You would never call him Mr. Hilu. You would call him Mr. Slim. Right? Okay. Vicente Fox was Vicente Fox Quesada. You call him Fox. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.